the three most important things to define in your personal branding. When developing a personal brand, there are so many things to consider. Not all of these things are created equal, however. Often, the different elements of branding strategies supplement each other, and should one area be lacking, it will have a negative impact on the whole brand and its resulting level of success. Once the following three foundational aspects are clear, the rest of your personal branding will fit together nicely. This presentation will outline the three most important things that need to be crystal clear in order for your personal branding to be strong and successful. 1. First, you need to define your target audience. When asked who your target audience is, your response should not be, oh, we're not being too specific. It is applicable to as many people as possible. You should understand your audience as if it can be boiled down to one specific image of a person. You need to know them specifically to ensure that they will relate to your content and view you as a credible and trustworthy source of information. In order to attract your audience, you must not be afraid to turn other people away. Two. Second, you need to define what you can do for your target audience. Now that you know who your target demographic is, you need to narrow down what you're going to do for them. You need to understand them entirely and know how to target your content precisely to their needs, wants, and desires. You can have the best branding, but if it does not appeal to your audience, what's the point? This also means analyzing the media that your audience uses and targeting them to specifically using that in ways that they will understand and listen. Put your branding in front of your audience in such a way that they cannot resist engaging with you. 3. Have a clear message. You need to be clear about what your personal branding is and what it stands for. What is the overall message you want to convey and why should your audience care about it? To help with this, refine and narrow down a simple version of your overall brand message to 25 words or less. What's more, do not sugarcoat it. What people want most in the world is to be told the truth. Now that you have your target audience, your goals, and your message, keep it in your mind. It can help to write them down somewhere as a constant visual of what you want to achieve. Once you have the three foundations to your personal branding, you can progress with the rest of your branding strategy. But like with the house, the whole thing will collapse if the foundation is done wrong. These pillars are imperative to the success of all personal brands and should be revisited often. Firstly, simply to remind you why you're doing what you're doing. And secondly, to make sure your content aligns with it. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.